Hey everybody, Space Windu here from the FX Saber Forums. I wanted to show you a new style lightsaber blade. You guys might already know about this. Uh, this was like first sort of researched and discovered by the Photonic Bladesmith on the FX Saber Forums. And he did a lot of research to show what kind of chemicals react with what types of wavelengths of light. Now, I'm not like really smart enough to understand uh, all about it, but you can go to maybe the description of this video. I'm going to put the, um, the link to FX Savers where Photonic Bladesmith goes through all the science and all the charts, all the uh, graphs that he has about how this works. But I'll try to just explain to you real quick like, like how I think it works. Um, it's a chemically en enhanced uh, lightsaber blade tube. Uh, where you can make your own lightsaber blade from the custom saber shop. Just go to the custom saber shop, um, look for this fluorescent enhanced tube. I think it's just a thin wall diameter right now, but maybe thick wall later, or maybe thick wall is available. I didn't, I didn't see that. Uh, but you could also get a pre-made blade from Vader's Vault. Uh, now it was Luminara from Vader's Vault from FX Sabers who. Uh, originally sort of told me that they were even available these style blades because I had seen Photonic Bladesmith post about the chemically enhanced lightsaber blades but I just thought it was his research I thought it would be five or ten years before like I could get my hands on something like that but uh, Luminara from FX Sabers you know told me that you know no she was doing research on um, on on these chemicals on making these blades happen I guess uh, her and Tim from the custom saber shop got together I think uh, Tim made these blade parts that you could buy uh, from the custom saber shop and Vader's vault makes the complete blades um, they look great I haven't seen one in in person but on their website you guys can go to their website and check out uh, the Vader's Vault, they're calling it the Photon Blade, because this is like uh, Photonic Bladesmith came up with it. I guess it's something that has to do with photons in the science, and something has to do with UV that's reacting to this chemical and producing uh, a weird green color, when, like I said, there's blue LEDs in here. So I'll, I'll shut up and you guys can check this out. So you can see it looks like on camera like it's like the teal. I like the aqua color in person. It is a really even blade. Now this is the string blade version so I have 108 LEDs running up and down this blade but this is blue LEDs. Um, pure blue, royal blue, what you're seeing right now is a minty green color. Okay, and I got this tip from the Custom Saber Shop. This is not a fluorescent tip. I'm just using this one for now. Maybe they're going to come out with fluorescent tip um, one, but this one actually looks really good. There's only like, when you get real close, can you tell that it's like not... Um, that it's that it's not of the of the fluorescent uh, chemical induced tip, but I put a mirror tip on the end of that, so you're not seeing any blue light through that. It's you know just the the green light only of the fluorescent enhanced uh, the chemically enhanced blade. Okay, so this is a string blade, like I said, so you should be able to see the light going up. But you could do this for your. Uh, inhale LED lightsaber too. You can get the blade from Vader's Vault. Uh, their style blade looks a little different from this because it has film in it. Um, this one here, like I said, it's a string blade. So if you don't know that um, what I put inside the string blade is inside here is another tube that I got from the custom saber shop. So it's like, you know, this outer tube that's a, a fluorescent style. And then inside another tube that diffuses 
that diffuses the light a little bit and then like deeper inside underneath that is a foam tube protecting the string of LEDs and also housing the flash strip which does special effects okay so this like uh, technique makes it really even as far as the string blade goes this looks like my friend said it over the weekend this looks like a combination of a string blade and um, and like a regular LED saber and, and I kind of agree with him because um, it I can't tell like that there's LEDs running through there it just looks like it looks like it's getting pretty close to a real lightsaber. And people ask me, uh, you know, if it's brighter than uh, like, this, like the standard green. But I think it's just a different style green. Like as you can tell, it's just a different... And I think it is brighter because what happens is part of the science, part of the science behind this blade is that it's going to catch other like ambient UV light like like it's gonna be brighter in the sunlight and I think uh, you could check one of my videos I have it like in some different lighting scenarios and it's becomes kind of brighter in the sun so that's another part of the science which is pretty cool but again at least for right at the moment you you really have to like green or this minty green because I'm not sure how other colors I know Vader's Vault is doing a bunch of tests to try to figure out like what LEDs inside there and what chemicals to mix um, that it's going to diffuse the light in different ways. So they want to make a red, you know, they want to make um, some different colors. But for right now, you can you can do this yourself by going to the custom saber shop and you know building. Uh, your own blade or you can get one from Vader's Vault. They're called the Photon Blades. Uh, this one here is just one that I made by putting this over top a uh, blue string. So if you have a blue LED in your saber you can get a blade like this and it's going to change your blue, normally blue saber into into a different type of color and what it looks like is in person like a whiter core and then on the edges is like neon, um, neon green, and then there's a cool, like weird aura. So maybe it's something that you want to try if you have a saber with a blue LED. All right, so like I said, check the description in this video. I'm going to try to put the Photonic Bladesmiths posts there. Um, thank you to Photonic Bladesmith for coming up with this technology. Like I said. I didn't even think I'd be able to like have it this soon, but uh, I just kind of saw it on Custom Saber Shop after Luminara from the FX Saber Forms told me that they were working with Tim to come out with this for people. So I can't believe how fast it happened. Um, thanks to Luminara, thanks to Alan at Vader's Vault, Deanna for researching this, coming out with this with Tim from the Custom Saber Shop. Um, and um, yeah, thank you. So this, uh, just in case I didn't say it already, this is a Crystal Focus LS lightsaber driving this blade, which is the light string blade. Um, but uh, as I said before, this technology is available for anyone with like a custom lightsaber with the one inch blade. All right. Thanks for watching this video.